Hi there guys, it's uh, Carlos here at Ultimate Fitness Training once again. Basically guys, today I'm just talking about uh, diet for um, basically preparation, for competition preparation. So I hope you guys uh, that are out there trying to get into top shape, uh, remember this. Okay, now there is many things that you need to think about and this is one thing that a lot of guys out there that try to compete sometimes fail. So I just put something together for you guys that obviously is step by step, sort of very simple guidelines um, before you guys even think about really competing. Right, first and foremost, make sure you've got your meals ready. So make sure you get into the sort of habit that you basically eat in every two and a half, three hours. Making sure you got your protein sorted, your carbs sorted, your fat sorted. Making sure you got water throughout the day. So I'm making sure that obviously you have at least four to five liters of water. So if you're dieting six, eight, 10, 12 weeks, making sure that you've got your meals ready every single day, it's absolutely crucial. So preparation in these terms is vital. So make sure you got that, okay? Now, the other thing is make sure you vary the sources of, not source, the sources of protein, carbohydrates, and fats. So don't just get eating chicken, chicken, chickens, because you'll get sick of it and your body will not be able to digest all the time chicken. So make sure, don't take me wrong, I mean, I have chicken a lot of the times, but it's good sometimes to mix it with tilapia, chicken, turkey, beef, so make sure you tuna, salmon, make sure you mix your proteins. Don't take me wrong, I know there's, there's, a, there's an element of, of uh, expense there too. Uh, however, make sure if you can and if you can afford it, please do mix your proteins as well as carbs. So sometimes you may have sweet potato, sometimes you may have rice, sometimes you have like normal potatoes, sometimes you, you may have pasta, depends, and so forth and so on, spaghetti and all sorts of stuff. But make sure you take in the, the, a, var a variation of um, ingredients there, okay? Same with the fats. Um, the water keep pretty much um, a good distilled water as well, because some of you guys probably don't understand this. Normal water is not good when you're competing, so make sure you get distilled water. There's many, many um, ways of doing that. You can either buy distilled water, or you can buy basic components and a filter to be able to do that. I'm not telling you which one's best. Um, to be honest, when I competed, I've done with the filter itself, and it's pretty cool, and it worked for me and I got pretty much 4% body fat on stage, so it's quite good. So that worked. Now, uh, what I was gonna say to you guys in terms of, of, of dieting is, make sure that you eat at regular meals, but make sure you also understand how much protein you're taking, how much carbs you're taking, how much fats you're taking. Now, you may speak to a so-called, um, you know, personal trainer out there that tells you, oh, you've got to have X amount of fats, X amount of carbohydrates. How does he know that? How does you know? And there's many equations out there that gives you exactly the amount. You can go on the internet, it gives you how much you weigh, bum bum bum, and it'll tell you exactly how much you gotta take, but they haven't seen your body composition. So a lot of the times, it's a bit of a trial and error, because you might be taking X amount of carbs, and all of a sudden you get flat as a pancake after three or four weeks. You might take in X amount of carbs, and you get absolutely blown up after two weeks. So sometimes you need to obviously have a bit of a trial and error, and why I advise sometimes to, if you're planning to diet, say, six or eight weeks, make sure you give yourself an extra week just in case um, you have to play a little bit with, uh, with your carbs, fats, and proteins. So that is crucial. Okay, now, the other thing is supplements. I'm not gonna go so much into detail each and every single supplement and what they do. I will do that in another video, but remember this, okay? Protein shakes are out of the window when you're dieting, okay? Some guys do it, especially if you do muscle modeling. Protein shakes are full of sugars, so obviously they've got to go out the window. So you've got to make sure that you're getting your protein from a good source of either turkey, tilapia, tuna, chicken, eggs, uh, egg whites. <laughs> uh, making sure you have that because protein shakes are full, of, full, full of sugars, okay? Now, if you're booking up, brilliant, but if you diet down, they're no good. Now, when you diet down as well, creatine's got to go. Some of you guys may disagree, but creatine holds a lot of water, so if you're gonna look lean, 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 Pro, uh, creatine is going to hold on to a lot of water in your system. So therefore, don't take money, you look, you look full and you will look uh, pumped up. And you looked, you will look, sorry, uh, very strong. However, you'll hold on to that water, which is you don't want on stage. So that's going to go as well. Now, the likes of glutamine needs to be in, the likes of uh, branch chains amino acids, um, omega-3, 6, and 9, crucial, you do oils, crucials, um, uh, lecithin, 
crucial, a nice at all, crucial. Uh, it might sound Chinese for some of you guys, but make sure you look up on this. I'll put this on literally uh, on um, on a screen very shortly. I'm sure you'll see. Um, I'll put that onto that detail. Vitamin C, multivitamin minerals, B6 and B12 complexes, and a form of fat burner if you can, because they will help you um, burn excess body fat. There is a couple more things I want to add, but I'll, I'll add that onto it onto another video but this is very much the basics making sure you have your proteins right make sure you got your carbs right making sure you got your meals prepared making sure you got your supplements throughout the day making sure you drink in plenty of water and train like an animal okay now do not change it you hear all these sort of people saying oh if you train uh, when you compete you gotta go light you gotta do this don't listen to these guys man don't listen to these guys. Look, tr your energy levels may be a bit lower. There's no choice about it, okay? But do not change your training drastically. The only thing you got to change is in the last week where you're depleting your glycogen a little bit if you're going to carb up. But realistically, as long as you're looking in shape, you pretty much can train more or less the same. It's just your energy levels. Obviously, let's say if you normally bench three plates or two plates and you, you hammer in it and you packing up the weight, or when you diet, you might not be able to do that. But you, you may be able to do that, but not for so many reps. Do you know what I mean? So make sure you're concentrating more on basically lifting the weight correctly and really getting that definition rather than boom, pumping the weight up. Okay? That's for you guys. Okay, now, on, on the other thing is making sure the structure is absolutely bang on. Because obviously you're going to get tired, you're going to get moody. So it's, sometimes it can be quite, quite hard to go and do a proper diet so until you're on that stage guys make sure you follow rules okay that's all it's all about and if you do that i'll bet you you'll get into the shape of your life i tell you, i guarantee you that okay so if you need any help guys uh, my name is carlos uh, i'm a master trainer level four uh, i've helped many many muscle models and bodybuilders get into top shape as well as obviously uh, other, other football and rugby uh, professionals um, i get people to top shape as well as into top physical level and psychological level so not just going to talk about the actual you know shape 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 because people that like performance i can get that i'm a strength and conditioning coach so i'll get you at top 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 shape and top 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 fitness level okay guys until next time guys it's carlos here our ultimate fitness training thanks for watching my video take care bye now